So I'm not going to be the only one alone whenever I say this, but what the fuck is going on with Resident Evil? I mean, Resident Evil is one of the most popular game franchises ever recognizable all over the world, has sold millions and millions of fucking copies, and has pretty much been on every major platform and sold a fuck ton of games for it, and garnered a fan base that's rabid and, well, really loyal. But there's just one thing that I'm noticing that is becoming... Uh, a problem, actually. And that's ever since Resident Evil 4, we had the great big departure in the gameplay. We didn't have everybody with the stiff robotic fucking movements where they, t they turned in place and our feet moved with them. You know, we didn't have the static backgrounds. We didn't have shit like that anymore. Uh, it controlled really well, actually. It was, it was awesome. It was a really great action game. But there in line, the problem, that, that, is an action game. Resident Evil was a survival horror game with action elements implemented. Well, that's the thing that worries me now, is that Resident Evil really doesn't have that jump out and scary type factor. Um, and it also isn't really spooky anymore. It doesn't have zombies, which is one of the main reasons that I have a big problem with it, is that I want undead shambling zombies that are half fucking retarded, and I want mutated hybrid monsters that are walking around. Um, instead, Resident Evil 4 and Resident Evil 5 are both filled with enemies who are intelligent and have guns. Let's see. Now, last time I checked, uh, Resident Evil is not Gears of Fucking War. And that's what Resident Evil 5 reminded me of. As soon as I was running around, I was ducking behind things, avoiding fucking enemies from hitting me with their sniper rifles, and their machine guns, and their shotguns, and everything else that they fucking had. It's like, dude, are you fucking kidding me? Like, you're, you're not a fucking zombie. You're just a, a bunch of fucking dudes with weapons just like me. This, this isn't fucking scary anymore. You know, they'll throw in the occasional fucking monster here and there, and it's just, it's not the same. It's like they're sprinkling parts of Resident Evil over Gears of War. That's what it feels like to me. Granted, I really liked Resident Evil 4 a whole lot, and I like Resident Evil 5, but I like it less than I do 4. But the thing is, I really just want the series to go back to how it was. I want, I want fucking to walk into a place where I'm like, okay, well, my character has to use the shitter, and I have to get, like, 14 fucking crests, and I need, like, 13 keys, and I have to solve some fucking, like, cryptic puzzle just so I can go and take a fucking shit. That's what I want again. I also want zombies walking around. I want them to come and devour my fucking brains. I want them to just be like, you died, as they're like chomping away at my fucking bits. You know, um, that, that's what I want. I want a tyrant walking around. I want Nemesis back again. Most of all, I want Barry back. Yeah. And to me, it's just, I don't know what direction they plan on going with the series. I mean, they keep going further and further and further into the future. Before we know it, everybody's going to be like 60 fucking years old and half crippled. Um, I, I, I don't really get it. Just, you know, make a Resident Evil game. Make it scary. Make it monsters and zombies and shit. Quit making me duck behind cover and avoiding fucking incoming fire because yeah, I'm not really digging it. And a lot of other people aren't really liking that too much either. Granted, it's fun, but it's not Resident Evil fun. You know, there's a big fucking difference. When you play Resident Evil 1, 2, 3, Code Veronica, those are all Resident Evil games. But Resident Evil 4 and 5 don't feel the same. They feel like such a large departure from the series that it just has the name and some of the characters, and that's about it. Um, oh, and get rid of the godforsaken fucking item system that they have in there. That shit is fucking garbage. It's like, okay, I played Diablo 1 and 2 a whole fucking bunch. And I love those games to death. You know what I hated about them? Their item system, because it's the same fucking thing. You're playing Tetris to move shit around constantly. Do you know how fucking long I played both of those games and was actually in a menu trying to be like, all right, well, I have to uh, move this around here. Oh, wait, oh, I better give this to Sheva. Oh, no, wait, no, oh, fuck. I, I can't pick up this fucking gun. Okay, I don't want to play a puzzle game in the middle of an action game that is trying to be survival horror, which has got a fucking name which it's not resembling anymore. Fuck that shit. That's retarded. Change it. Change it back to how it was and just update it for nowadays. I want the game to be scary again. I want really fucked up stuff. I want to feel like I'm really in a fucking horror movie and I'm fighting for my life to fucking get through all the odds with some goofy storyline about some 
like pharmaceutical company that's taking over the world because they're crazy. I like that. That makes me happy. That makes me... And the recent ones have been making me go... So, yeah. And I think a lot of other people that at least I've talked to feel the same exact way. My friends in general have all had the same complaints. Granted, we all bought Resident Evil 4 and 5 because we're diehard fans. And there are a lot of things about the games to like. But at the end of the game, when you're finished with it, it still feels lacking. And that's the problem. The other Resident Evils I didn't feel quite as lacking. I mean, hell, Resident Evil 3, I got to see Barry in a helicopter. Which is the last time anybody saw him. I want to hear more about Jill Sandwiches, for fuck's sake. Jill fucking Sandwiches. I mean, Barry, he has this. This is his gun, by the way. You know, Resident Evil Remake, they called it Barry's Gun because it's so fucking epic and it does damage that a rocket launcher does. That's why he should be back. Then he's fucking silly and crazy. So, yeah. And, oh, I don't want Sheva to come back again. Fuck her. I don't want people like Carlos to come back or fucking Steve from Resident Evil Code Veronica. Quit throwing in characters because it's obvious every time you throw in some fucking, like, little buttfuck character, nobody really wants them around. They just kind of, shoo, go on. Run off. Okay, I'd rather Rebecca come back. Literally. You know, you remember Rebecca. Yeah. You know, Rebecca. Well, I'd rather her come back. Just, you know, st stick to the fucking, like, rules. Zombies versus a bunch of trained, like, soldiers. STARS members. I don't know what the fuck STARS members really are. They're like cops, SWAT, FBI, CIA agent people, crazy secret mission zombie killers. And that's what the fuck we want. We want zombies back. We want crazy puzzles back. We want scariness back, because it's supposed to be survival horror. So bring it back, Capcom. Make us fucking happy. And make sure that Barry's in the game at some fucking point. And I want him in the story. Not in just a mercenaries mode. I like mercenaries mode, but I want him in the story. I want to be able to play as him and fuck shit up, because goddammit, he's important. And Resident Evil is really important to us, so fix it.